After a brief trial period, the potion shop opens to great success. Okay. Uh. <sighs> we just keep getting swarmed with more and more customers. It's been non-stop work for so long, Paimon's starting to feel a little bit lightheaded. Uh, isn't business sure is booming? Made quite a name for ourselves, after all. We've got a lot of orders. Paimon's not sure we can fill them all on our own. Yeah. Uh, maybe we should hire some help. <laughs> Think? Taking a break, cuties? I was just looking at the sales data, and it seems like you two have quite the talent for business. The potions seem to be flying off the shelves. Oh, Lisa! Perfect timing. We were just talking about how we could use some help around the shop. Oh, are the orders piling up already? Having trouble keeping up? Yep, we're officially swamped. Paimon never thought we'd get this many customers. Well, I can't say I'm surprised by the success. I was actually anticipating this kind of response. While you two were busy with the shop, I was talking with Freda about some possible ways to make the business more efficient. It? Oh, thanks. After observing your work, I made note of several improvements we can make to the brewing, cultivation, and sales aspects of the business. All right. Wait, so you've been doing things behind the scenes this whole time? Yeah, she's just been busy. Hyman kind of thought you were just slacking off. <laughs> hey now, I'm actually pretty reliable when it counts. So how are we supposed to put those improvements in action? Well, I discussed things over with Freda, and the two of us came up with a plan. Plan? I'll let her give you the details, though. Why don't you go and find her? Sure. Let's see what she has to say. Eleven. Definitely, there's definitely some people that been before. Okay. Right. All right, Brenda, talk to me. Traveler, Paimon, hello. Is there something I can help you with? Well, we've been a bit swamped lately, so Lisa recommended we find some ways to increase our efficiency. Uh, yes, I've discussed that with her as well. Currently, there are three areas you can improve. Brewing, cultivation, and sales. Increasing your efficiency in these areas will make it much easier to run your business. Wow, that sounds just like what we need! Let's give it a try, Traveler! Well, let's just, uh, improve operating efficiency. Looks like... all the preparations needed for this upgrade have been made. Please, try it out. Alright. Uh, chemical efficiency. Lucky Wish, rank 1. When contracting potions, the chance of a lucky bonus is increased to 30%. When the lucky bonus is obtained, the level of the potion will be additionally increased. Uh, craft, listen to recent inquiry. Amount of alchemy level at P received increased by 30%. Oh, I can get all that. It's a lot higher, though. This type activated after over operation bonuses reached max level. 
When constructing potions, the maximum number of characteristics that can be shown is increased by one. Potion gain five bonus levels, and maximum potion level is increased by five. Right? Um. Wait, wait. The amount of potions type stock to increase to four. Well, I definitely those. Uh, base potion sales volume increase to two bottles. Uh, when obtaining ingredients, the chance of lucky bonuses increase to 30%. Base ingredient production by 50%. Ingredient appearance gained when crafting potions or analyzing ingredients increase by 15%. Uh, Yai Publishing House is holding a light novel contest and the authors are searching for inspiration. So wisdom. Um, wisdom, focus, and... Um, what else? Wisdom, focus, and dexterity, I think. There have been frequent disturbances in the desert lately. The Garden of our village is leading the other guards in the defense against monster attacks. Right. Harvest. Can it spend? Funds and consume special. Uh, wait. And spend funds and consume special alchemical fertilizers to increase rate at which your ingredients will. I will you to directly obtain them. Funds consumed will be decided by the amount of operational cycles remaining before a given ingredient would have. So there's a way to accelerate the process, but. I don't mind. Want to know is um. Dude, wait, wait. Do have to focus on. Just out in cauldron upgrade. Better. <clears throat> Ultimate cauldron upgrades. Nice. Definitely that. This can shape the same as um Hello Lily, I think. Oh Snapdragon. Snapdragon. Oh, this one is mass. Okay. And to shop store. Constitution and charisma. Strength. Charity. Need wisdom. It's charity. That's good. I'm, I'm happy with that. And operation cycle. Quick 
Crows. Oh, hey. <laughs> Greetings, Traveler Paimon and Lisa. Zeus, hey. it's been a while since the last time we saw you. Yep. On the way here, I overheard quite a few people talking about alchemical potions. At first, I was worried something might have gone wrong with the herbs. But judging by the way people were talking, it seems like they were pretty pleased with the results. <laughs> Sucrose, your bioalchemical expertise was exactly what we needed for potion making. Yeah, we've been able yep. to make potions with all sorts of different effects. You mastered potion making in such a short amount of time? I guess that's expected for someone of your talent, Traveler. I wouldn't be surprised if you became a potion master one day. Hey, hey, slow down. I'm just a beginner. Still, still got a long way to go. Still, if you manage to master potion making in such a short amount of time, we should be able to start teaching the public about it as well. Wait, was that also a part of Jean's plan? Yep. It's something she and Mr. Albedo talked about. As I understand it, the goal was not just to create and sell potions, but also to teach the principles and practices of alchemy to the people. Thanks to your shop, the public's understanding of alchemical potions has increased quite a bit. Perhaps, one day, they'll even be able to make simple potions themselves. Hmm... Without the proper training, though, those potions could be dangerous to use. Yep. You're right. With Lisa there to mentor you, Traveler, we could rest assured that nothing would go wrong during the potion-making process. However, when it comes to the general public, we have to think of a way to ensure that any resulting potions would be safe to use. So... Mr. Albedo is planning to establish a set of criteria to evaluate various levels of potion-making ability. People will have to pass the exam that corresponds to their level of proficiency before being allowed to brew their own potions. Let me guess. You would like us to also take part in this exam? Yes. Although it would probably be more accurate to say that we would like you to help us finalize the contents of the exam. In order to ensure a proper level of difficulty, we need to first collect the relevant data. That's where our mock exam comes in. If you could take it, Traveler, your results would serve as a very important reference for us. You will, of course, be compensated for your efforts. <laughs> what a great idea. I must admit, I'm very interested to see how much my cutie's alchemy skills have improved. Yeah, well, uh, guess, uh, give it a go. Bring it on. <laughs> Confidence is a good look on you, cutie. Wonderful. Then, let me explain a little bit about how the exam works. The exam has four levels. Beginner, Intermediate, Advanced, and Expert. To pass, all you need to do is brew a potion within the time limit that satisfies the main objective. Satisfying additional objectives will earn you extra rewards. Okay, all of this is starting to sound pretty official. Paimon's nervous all of a sudden. Just do what you normally do and you should be fine. If you don't pass the first time around, you can always retake the exam. So, no need to put too much pressure on yourselves. Oh, retakes are allowed! Whew, that's a relief. Yep. Just let me know when you're ready. Right. Check the exam requirements. Alchemy exams are tests intended to assess your potioneering techniques. The exam is split into several stages that must be completed in sequence. You have three attempts to 
three attempts for each stage. Additionally, potions produced during the exams will not be saved. They will instead be refunded the ingredients consumed during the exam. Each test, each test stage comes with its primary and secondary objectives. Complete the primary objective to pass the test, and complete the secondary objective to increase your test rating. Test rewards are based on your rating. If you fail the exam, you must wait a certain period for retaking the exam. Right? Let's see. Archery exam. Complete the primary objective to pass the Complete secondary objectives to earn bonus bonus rewards. I concoct a potion of intermediate or higher grade, whose efficiencies include constitution. Alright. Uh, potion grade which is intermediate and potion level which is plus five. So intermediate intermediate and plus five. Potion displays at least one characteristic. Use no more than three types of ingredients. Pass the exam to unlock uh, operation bonuses. Upmarket offensive rank one. In exam, goes uh, in the gradual realm. Gradual realm. Okay. Uh, in the intermediate or higher grade purchases include constitution. That. This, then, here, hmm. how many ingredients, no more than three times of ingredients. Types of Here in the um, here. I hope right way. Well, I think I had this completed. This secondary objective, ocean rates which is in plus five. Um nah, wasn't able to do that. But at least there's one characteristic, every type of ingredients, and this constitution. Not going to retake the exam. Alright. 
don't have the time to do so. Hmm. Your movements are quite practiced, and your potion meets the requirements as well. Congratulations on passing the beginner exam. Hmm. That beginner was a piece exam. Of cake. Eh, it had its uh, challenging moments. Even so, it was no match for your skills. All right. I believe I've collected all the necessary feedback. Looks like we'll have to make some adjustments to the level of difficulty for the actual exam. I'm gonna head back to the lab now. See you later, Traveler and Paimon. See you. Alright. Ordinary. Operation bonus is unlocked. Come out to the rank one. Did it right, but I did. 